Hello everybody, my name's Scott with Wet Shaving Reviews. I want to do a short video. I'm hoping it's going to be short. It's a, about a product that I got from AliExpress. It's a razor. I took it out of the package, of course. You can see that. It's got a bunch of Chinese writing on it. Um, they had it on AliExpress and it, uh, it was on sale. It was only $1.92 free shipping. How could I go wrong? Well, we're gonna find out. <laughs> Here's the razor. It says Gillette right on the front of it. You can tell it's very cheaply made. I mean, real, real light. It's just, it's... It might last a little while, but if you need a, something cheap to get you by until you get the money to get something better, that's what this review is all about to see if it'll work the blade I got it out of the package here it's got some Chinese writing on it on one side the other side it says Gillette super stainless China so we're gonna put this together and see what we can do I am a little bit scared. <laughs> I've watched YouTube videos where people use these cheap razors and they stop halfway in between their shave and they end up getting another razor. So needless to say guys, I have another razor sitting right beside me, just in case. All right, the soap of the day, cheap, 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 but works great. Arco. I like this stuff. There's a lot of people that don't like it, don't like the smell of it. I actually took it and stuck it in a bowl. And I'd watched videos where they said you had to shave it off, you know, to stick it in a bowl. I didn't, you know, I didn't use nothing to, no razor or nothing to shave it or a cheese grater. I just, I got two of those, two of these here, and I took one of them. Took it out of that, broke it in little small pieces, and kept pushing it down in this bowl until it, you know, it looks pretty good in there. I actually, I've I've used it a couple times. So, and the brush for today, friend of mine, Mark, actually sent it to me to try out. It is a razor rock with a soft knot. I think that's how you pronounce that. So we're gonna put some of this Arco to the face and check it out. I'm really excited about that razor though. I mean, if $1.92, if it works, um, hey, you know, that's our aftershave for the day. I like the feel of that stuff. There's a lot of people that don't, but I like the feel of it on my face. All right, I'm gonna wet the face here real quick. Well, I'm still learning. Too, guys um, I've only been wet shaving for six seven weeks I've always shaved with an electric razor so we'll see how this is gonna go I didn't get enough water on my brush here. I'm gonna dip it in there. I'll tell you guys what though, for a $10 brush, you can't go wrong. I mean, I 
I like it. It's not my favorite, but it works. It gets the job done. It's actually really soft. I mean, it's... I've not had any... Any problem out of this brush. Look at that lather. That Arco, man, I'm telling you. A lot of people hate it, but for the price. I like it, and it makes a good lather. I always get it on my ears and drives me crazy. I don't know about you guys, but that's how I am. All right, guys, you ready for this? We're gonna try it. Well, I can tell you right off the bat, it's really mild. Like, I would say to the 34C or the 34G, either one. I don't have the 34C, but I have the 34G. If that was a five, this would, on aggressiveness, I would say this would be a two. I mean, it's, we're gonna see how this goes. I'll probably stop at three passes, but even if it's going to take four. <laughs> but I'll tell you what. I can't use a Derby Extra Blade at all. I, They feel like they're ripping my hairs out. But this blade ain't doing too bad. but it could be because it's a very mild razor too. And mild razor, you know. If you guys are watching this and wondering why I'm not standing at a sink or you know you're not looking at a mirror <laughs> it's a uh, I actually had back surgery the November 20th so I'm not able to well I'm able to stand up and walk around but I'm supposed to be walking with a walker and I really don't want to hang on to something try to record a video and shave at the same time. The ones that's already subscribers knows that. So just, I've had a lot of people ask me, why do you got a blue background? Why are you sitting down? <laughs> Just figured I'd put that out there before anybody even says anything on this video. And I've noticed too, you know, a lot of people, and it's, I'm sure it's not just my YouTube, you know, I'm just starting out, but I've talked to quite a few guys that's got YouTube channels and, you know, my first video it'll show you on YouTube, you know, how long somebody has watched your video. And most people only watch a couple minutes. 
at least that's what it shows. Um, and I thought it was just me. I thought, oh man, I'm just very bad at this. I need to quit. <laughs> but everybody's like, no, no, Scott, you, you know, stick at it. It's, that's normal. <laughs> you know, that's normal. So I was like, all right, well, we'll see how it goes. You know, I mean, if people like it, they like it. I'm here for the fun of it. I'm here to do reviews and let people know what I think um, of different products and make friends. I've met a lot of nice people on Facebook and shaving communities. A couple of my really, really close friends now that I talk to more than I do the friends that I have that live close to me, actually, is on Facebook. Um, and they're wet shavers. And I'd met them in wet shaving groups. Like Craving Shaving. That's uh, me and a friend of mine, Charles. He's got a YouTube channel. Um, it's called Craving shaving, of course. Um, me and him was talking about it and decided to start a YouTube and or start a, a Facebook with his YouTube channel. So he uh, he finally he said, yeah, you know, as long as you're going to be with me and help me run it and it's going to be something that's ours, I'm all for it. So I was like, well, you know, I will. He's... He, uh, he makes brushes and, you know, sells brushes on Etsy and different places. And, you know, he's, he's big into Instagram. And uh, so we started that group. And then once I started my YouTube, I started a group that's Wet Shaving Reviews, that's the name of the group on Facebook, just like it is on the YouTube channel. So, if you would, like and subscribe. You can um, find us on Facebook if you have any questions concerns, something you want, you know, you'd like to see a review about. If I got the product, I'll do the review. If I don't have the product and the review is not on YouTube, I will, I will find somebody that has that product and I'm sure they will do the review. I mean, the, the wet shaving community is very very nice people I've never in my life had a hobby with such nice people willing to help you out willing to you know do all they can for you well that's the second pass guys let me wet the face a little bit here. I know in my first couple of videos, <laughs> my wife actually was watching the videos and she's like, you know, you're looking off to the side an awful lot. And I told her, I said, well, the way I got everything set up because I'm not actually standing at the sink doing it. I got the, you know, my camera's right in front of me. I got a little mirror right above me here, right above the camera. And it's a, you know, it's a small mirror. It's not big by no means. And uh, I got a little chair in front of me with a tub of water. I got a table beside me that's got the stuff that I'm using and a big, you know, like a bowl of water. And, uh, you know, I got another little seat on this side that's got my soap. Uh, you know, I got my whole little setup going on here. But I 
had another mirror because I don't know if, you know, you guys are probably not even interested in this stuff, but I'm just talking. Um, but that I'm going to have to do another pass. That's not very close at all. But um, on my first two videos, actually I had another mirror set up because I'm recording this with my phone. And when you're recording with your phone, I can't have it facing me because if I do, it turns all of my products around. You know, it's like if I'm holding this up and it says Razor Rock, it'll look like you're looking at it in a mirror. I mean, it'll be, you know. So I had another mirror set up over there and I was looking at that mirror to make sure I was still in the camera. And uh, evidently that was a, a bad deal. I shouldn't have done that. So this time, I've not got that mirror over there. I still got the little mirror above me that I'm looking in. I'll tell you what, for this, this brush, I'm telling you though, 10 bucks, you guys seen, I loaded it one time. And it's got enough to do a three pass shave in it. Which that's got a lot to do with the Arco too. Arco's great. I I'm telling you. Cheap, 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 cheap. I mean, I, I think I gave you can get just one of these. Um just one of these online for like a dollar or something, I think. Maybe two dollars. I don't know. They're not they're not real expensive at all. Um But you can't beat it for the price. It's not the favorite thing in the world. It's not the best smelling, but the, to me, the smell is not bad. I mean, and I actually hear a lot of people um, and. I didn't know you could do this either because of course I'm I'm new to this I'm learning you know just like most of you guys are if you're watching this video you could be you know wanting to know about a product or you're just getting into wet shaving and you're wanting to know how to do it or you know um, just stuff like that there's different reasons you're here but I've learned a lot and I've learned that you can take soaps and if you don't like the smell of them a lot of soaps, um, one guy, he's an older gentleman, he's actually in his, in his late 70s, he was telling me he takes um, oils and he'll put, like in his bowl with his soap, he'll put a couple drops of oil, you know, peppermint oil or tea tree oil or whatever kind of oil, you know, um, just different oils he'll put in the top of his soap, he buys cheap soaps too, and he just puts oil in the top you know, the, to give it a different smell and to give it better slickness, you know, if it don't have slickness. So there, there is a lot, like this soap here, now that I've been sitting here talking for a second, it's not very wet. It's, you know, I'm going to put some more water on it and go again. That's part of the reason why some of these videos <laughs> is uh, a little long. And I don't edit nothing out. I might eventually down the line, but as of right now, I ain't gonna lie, I don't even know how to do it. I mean, I have no reason to lie to nobody. You know, my mom, she, uh, she passed away six years ago, but she always told me, if you, son, if you have to lie about something, Keep your mouth shut. Don't say nothing at all. And that's the truth. It's the way I look at things, you know. If I'm gonna lie about something, why even open my mouth? I'm not I'm not about to lie. And I'm not getting paid for none of these reviews.
nobody's paying me to review a, you know, a dollar ninety two razor. If you go buy this razor, I'm not getting nothing off of it. But I'm telling you, right now, for a dollar ninety two, it'll work. If you're just starting out, I think it would be great. The only reason why I say that is because it's really mild. I mean, you guys can't see that, I'm sure. Um, even if I hold my hand up there, I don't think you can see that that blade gap. Um, let me get a little bit closer here. But it is really, really... Uh, I don't know. But anyhow, I, uh, I would compare this... I would say I got I got a 2C and if you got a 2C it's got two sides you know you got your one and three I've shaved with the three this the one it's it's like just it ain't even doing nothing it's just you know sliding down your face um, I would say I've, I've not got the 6C so I don't have the number two to compare it to but I would say it would be the number two it's that mild so you know to me that's what I would you know I would say yeah um, but that's just me but the blade on that man I'm telling you I don't I might actually look just to see how cheap they are just so I can try a little a little pack of them I mean if if the whole razor and all was a dollar ninety two um, which that was on sale. I I don't know if I forgot to tell you that or not. It was, but it wasn't like really really on sale. It was it was only three dollars and something. You know, I only gave a dollar ninety two, but I got it, you know, half off. And another thing with AliExpress is if you've never had an account with them, um, and you download the app, you get four dollars off of your purchase if it's over four dollars you know so if you get on there and you buy something that's ten dollars you know you're only gonna pay six for it because you know that's that's how I did now I'd never you know I mean you get four dollars off you get different stuff um, I've ordered some stuff off of there the thing I will tell you is if you order something off of AliExpress it takes forever I mean I've I've waited a month month and a half you know, to get products from there. Um, the Allen block I am going to use is the only one that I got. I, I, I use it a lot. <laughs> it's Gentleman John. And I've showed this a lot on most of my videos, but I'm, I'm only doing this because I think it's it's wrong, and I think, you know, I'm, I'm actually going to get a hold of them, and I've tried a couple times, but not got no response. Um... If you can see that, you might be able to see that. There's a big circle, big old hole, like big enough I can stick part of that, you know. It, it goes back in, I'd say about a half an inch. You know, and I've said this in a couple of my videos. I mean, it's, it's not, to me, it's not right. I mean, you buy something, you buy something. You don't want a big chunk of it missing. But it does work good. It, I mean, it might just be one bad apple, you know. I have I know guys that's got them and says that theirs was fine. You know, they, or, and I've heard guys that's got them said that, well, they had little pieces missing, but never, never as much as this one here. But I don't like it because you dip it in water and it holds water in that spot. And then, of course, it drips all over you. And for me setting down you know for you guys and and girls you know I, I did actually and that's another thing i want to i want to give give a shout out i don't even know this lady um but uh i actually watched a youtube video today of a woman shaving um i thought that was cool i don't care what anybody else thinks you know i mean to me anybody can shave i mean and, and like she said in her video that i just watched 
you know, she, she said, uh, she made the comment, she said, there's a lot of women that shave, but they just don't let nobody know it, you know, and, and I believe that, I mean, but I can't even, I can't, can't remember her name, I really can't, um, I'll put her name in the description though, I mean, that's, you know, and I don't know her, I, I've never talked to the lady at all, never, not once, but I thought it was very cool and liked, you know, that she was doing videos. So to me, that's, you know, a good thumbs up there. If you're watching this, if you ever come across my video, you know, I thought you did a great job. Um, of course, the aftershave of the day. Now, this is one of the aftershaves that I've not put in a spray bottle yet um, but I like this stuff I mean seem to do all right it feels good yeah most of my aftershaves I uh, I go to Walmart 98 cents spray bottle you know open the top spray it on I just feel like I waste too much you know doing it out of the bottle but uh, I do appreciate you guys watching my video um, don't forget please like and subscribe um, there will be a lot more to come like I said uh, Facebook wet shaving reviews group you know you want to get a hold of me I'll leave my email address, which is Shaving with Scott. Very easy to remember. Um, it's at gmail.com. I'll leave that down in the description and everything that I've used. Um, if I can find some of these products, I can leave, you know, websites down in the bottom. But, um, you know, like the Razor Rock brush, RazorRock.com, um, AliExpress. You know, if you go to and you get on your phone if you download the app on your phone I do know if you do that you get four dollars off which is great and just don't buy nothing that you need for Christmas because it's close to Christmas um, I actually made that mistake last year I bought a I bought some things for you know family members off of there for Christmas and I bought them five weeks before Christmas I figured that would give it plenty of time and it said it would be here two weeks before Christmas, and it didn't show up until three weeks after Christmas. So, I, you know, that's a big, don't buy nothing for Christmas. <laughs> if you want something on AliExpress, buy it. But it's going to take a long time to get it. I mean, I, I've had um, maybe one or two things that I bought off AliExpress that's been here within three weeks. But everything else has been a really long time. Um, and way to go for Arco. I mean, that stuff, I'm telling you, if you've never tried it, give it a try. Um, I never actually tried it with the stick. I just went straight to the bowl with it. But as soon as I'm done with that bowl, actually, maybe even before then, I might just rip this paper off of this and try to, you know, do it with the stick because I do have some um, tobacco in the stick. And... I like the fact that you can take it to the face with a stick and then, you know, but just sitting here talking a little bit of time, this stuff, I can really feel it. It's, you know, it's like a really cool sensation feeling that I'm getting from it. And I really like that. Um, but as for the shave, is it BBS? No, not by a long shot. Will it get me by? Yeah, it get me by. Um, I could probably do a touch-up pass, you know, in just a couple. I got a, a spot there that's got some I can still fill a little bit. Um, you know, a spot right there. Other than that, it's it's pretty good. A couple spots on my neck, but I don't I don't try to get real close to my neck. Um, you know, I don't I don't try to get a BBS on my neck because if I do. You know, uh, it looks really, really bad, and then I don't want to shave the next day. And I'm a shaver every day. You know, I shave one day on here on YouTube, 
and one day on my Facebook group I go live and I shave there either on my Facebook group or on craving shaving group in Facebook um, both of them I'm really active in uh, there's a lot of good guys guys I mean you know and girls you know if if I can meet that lady that was shaving in that video that I met or that I watched tonight more power to you ma'am I will take you and put you in my group and love to have some you know chats with you about shaving I mean I think that is just cool um, as for that I hope you guys have good shaves and don't forget to please like and subscribe I know I say that a lot but I only got six or seven people so far um, you know a buddy of mine he's like we're getting ready to do the two subscription giveaway because there was only two of us in so but you guys uh, have a great one uh, I'll be on next time.